it makes me feel a little bit more mentally strong and capable sometimes than even physically strong. My name is Tanya Flores, and I am a major gift fundraiser for the James and CrossFitter, ex-college athlete, pursuing life dreams person, I guess. <laughs> I am a stepmom and a wife and cyclist sometimes and try and do all the things. <laughs> It was a Tabata, was the first workout I remember actually doing. And I was surprised by how hard it was, because it seemed pretty easy. I, I had done like high intensity interval training and, you know, felt really f pretty fit from cycling. And we do a lot of, you know, interval training or hill climbing mixed with sprints. and but it was just body weight movement that I hadn't done in a really long time. And it was probably pretty simple, like air squats and push-ups. And I remember trying to do push-ups and get into five and being like, I can't, I can't do this. <laughs> but it was good. I was like, I, imme I immediately wanted to be like, let's do it again. Like I have to do better at this. And I was hooked. I think CrossFit is a mixture of strength mixed with vulnerability. I think you have to really be vulnerable to recognize where you are in order to gain the strength that CrossFit gives you. And that can be a really humbling experience. Um, I know it has been for me as someone who's naturally competitive on several occasions, just looking in the metaphorical mirror and going, okay, I don't know if I can do this. And then by the end, no matter how you got it done, you feel super accomplished and strong, maybe more mentally than even physically. And I think that's what CrossFit means to me. It, it makes me feel a little bit more mentally strong and capable sometimes than even physically strong. And I think I see that in a lot of the people here at the gym too, and how you, they, everyone around you is allowing themselves to be both vulnerable and strong too. And that's a really powerful community. I don't think anyone thinks they're in good enough shape to do CrossFit. <laughs> I think I was in good shape and I wasn't in good enough shape to do CrossFit, but I think I'd say to that person, everyone has their own starting point. So swim in your own lane, you know, be okay with where you're at and know that in a year from now or months from now or weeks from now, you won't be there. You'll be someplace else and to enjoy that and don't fear it be excited about it um, because there's people who are here to help you get there and um, you're going to have a lot of folks who are excited to see what you're going to accomplish even if you don't think you can and um, it could be very very little things but everything is a step forward. Um, someone told me once uh, the tr like the saying like well you go backwards no you never go backwards you just get back on the train where it was and that's where you're starting and that there's no place to go but forward so come and start and don't be don't be worried about that forget about that <laughs> CrossFit will you'll, there will always be something so even when you're fit maybe you're still not fit enough to do something that you want to do so there's always you won't ever be satisfied if you stop yourself from starting. I love a lot of things about Superfit. Um, I mean, I love the workouts I do. I love CrossFit. And I was not, I was like a CrossFit hater. So, so I love like that it's all set up really simply. You come in, you do the work and you see and you see results, whatever those are. And I love that Superfit has 
the um, has that setup, but at the same time, I think it's a really unique community, and I love that about Superfit too. I think people recognize when you're not here and care um, about you and not just the CrossFit version of you. And people want you to do really well, but not just really well at the gym, but like really well in life. And they're here, they're there for you. So like when you're sick and you're not here for a couple days, it's like, well, how are you doing? And I don't know if you would get that everywhere else. You know, I've done a lot of different activities and you could come and go and no one would ever notice. And I think here people notice each other and they care about each other. And, um, you know, Brian and Amanda have set up something that's really special. And maybe I can't put my finger on it, but you feel it when you're here. And when I'm not here, I feel bad about not being here. It's like, oh, I want to be at the gym and I want to hang out after the workouts and I want to do things with people. And so that makes you want to come back. And sometimes I don't even want to come to the gym and do the workout. I just want to come see the people. So I think that's what I love about Superfit. Thank you.